Hello everyone. So this is a part of a down the tree curve with a electrical hub 250 watt at 328 rpm with the standard cablage electrical wire connected to a Kelly KBS controller you have the program plug here and wired on a LiPo 22.2 volt charged at 2.5 volt like this and you can plug in like that and I have already programmed the Kelly KBS but with this uh, video you can view the programmable guy of the Kelly eh? so I take the camera on it and I can push the from and you can view the reel that it can spin. I have used a programmable a program with the throttle rate a setting at 8 that you can uh, have a, a very smooth start to avoid the the, the current peak or the throttle peak on the fork huh? Okay, and now the program the program part. For this, you must unplug the battery uh, to uh, see the motor don't spin, like the manual of Kelly indicate this. You must plug the battery, the main battery, if you have. Uh, 3, 6 volt is not a problem huh? and plug the USB converter to the series port like this ok be careful huh? on my uh, mechanical assembly the cable is very touch the and then you can plug the USB converter on the desktop. It's a Windows 7. And then load the KBS program like this. It's a touch screen. Huh? And you have this. So you can move the max motor current or the max battery current. You can read the instruction to setting this. You can uh, set the voltage of the whole accelerator. 
so if you would uh, D the zone you can have this on the start accelerator and on the end of accelerator uh, twist the good setting uh, with uh, this uh, mini motor the 8.3 mm for uh, a little bike it's this so in this setting I have uh, limited the current battery to 10 ampere and you can push the next button on this screen you have the startup after you have plugged the power so uh, I have setting 2 seconds so after 2 seconds the Kelly controller start to work huh? all the sensor is always 1 to 0 degree I prefer the control mode setting to speed it's more easy for me and I have setting this voltage for the LiPo 22.2 volt and the uh, throttle up turn rate is the, the low reaction of the accelerator twist normally it, it is set to 4 but in this application I prefer setting to 8 and uh, the security systems so uh, when you have uh, when you plug the battery and you have not set the accelerator level to zero the Kelly controller don't work and you can go to the next in this section you can uh, set the maximum speed and set the other function that, that I have not used on this uh, mechanical assembly. Eh? I use only the twist, the power, the Kelly, and the motor. It's all. Not complicated uh, brake uh, level uh, or uh, contact that can uh, cut the normal work. Eh? Next, in this setting you can use the regeneration setting that I can I can't not use because it's a free wheel motor hub. Huh? You can move uh, normally on the front like this. Huh? So in this panel, I have disactivate, disable this uh, function. On this part, you have the temperature sensor. If you have, on this motor, I uh, I don't think I have this part, but I have a, a white wire that I have not connected. Perhaps it's the sensor wire, but in this application I don't use. And when I finish to set the the, the parameter, you can uh, send this to the Kelly. When you push on the finish, so this is you have the complete message and yes you must close the program and yes you must unplug the battery to set the new parameter uh, on the Kelly eh? so I have uh, uh, 8 throttle rat In, it is a smooth reaction now I have set the Kelly Yes, next, like this, I move 
to the most fast throttle rat like this and I program the Kelly like this and okay I unplug the battery and plug the USB controller and plug the battery like this and then when I use the new setting of the control rat you have the the instantly uh, react of the accelerator and not the smooth reaction of the 8 setting of the throttle rat huh? on this setting you have uh, the maximum current uh, too huh? so the, the fork of the bike must be dimensioned for this huh? for the throttle you must uh, use a, a torque arm or uh, excuse me a torque arm for this oh a problem apparently yes a problem so i unplug the kelly for two seconds and plug the kelly and it work good I think I have reached the current setting on my uh, system I uh, restrict to 10 ampere it's all uh, perhaps uh, a not good setting for the speed throttle rat setting at 1 okay Another setting, so I unplug, plug the USB, plug the battery, then, and load Kelly, yes, and move to the max to the max controller setting uh, on this uh, Kelly KBS it's um, 5 0 ampere for 10 seconds and then it decreased to 2 0 ampere so I set this finish program is ok and plug the convertisseur and plug the battery and plug so you have with this setting you don't have the the default on the current that I, I, I have uh, uh, previously yeah? but it's a problem for the, the motor it have uh, the 250 watt max setting yeah? ah, another problem ok you can unplug the battery plug the battery and it's ok but I think it's a problem with the throttle rat a normal setting is 4 you can uh, set 1 but I don't use 1 my normal setting is uh, 6 or 8 in these application uh, data so I restrict the setting already and plug the battery plug the convertisseur 
plug the battery and load the Kelly program and set to my personal setting so like this like this and uh, it's all so the next parameter is the throttle rat to 8 for me and next next always finish and yes and plug the converter and plug the battery plug the battery and this is the normal setting for me so you have the smooth start for this small uh, motor uh, on this situation you have view that I have reached the max torque and the max speed. Uh, remember that the Kelly KBS is a sensored controller. It view the speed of the motor hub. So if you use the twist, the twist is not regularly because the whole sensor is used even in the free wheel setting. So the, the twist, it's not uh, logical for a normal user. But for me, it's okay. It's a good uh, reaction. And it's all. It's the Kelly KBS system. And programming part.